Welcome to Electra Online, and here we have a different kind of subtraction with double digit numbers. And I will be teaching you a very interesting trick on how to do that. Let's, for example, take 84 minus 36. What I like to do is I like to turn this into a 40. I need to add four more to this to turn this into a 40. What I'm going to do instead, and I'll write it down so you can see what I'm trying to do here, I'm going to take 84 and subtract 40 from that, which means I added four to this number. In other words, I'm subtracting four more than I should. But that's an easy number to subtract because I know that 84 minus 40 is equal to 44. 8 minus 4 is 4, 4 minus 0 is 4. But remember, I subtracted 4 more than I should, then I have to add that again to the final answer. 4 plus that gives me 48, and that's the answer to the subtraction. Did you like that? I hope you did. Let's try it again. Here, I'm subtracting 25 from 52. I realize that 5 is bigger than 2, which makes it difficult to do. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add to that, but in other words, I'm going to subtract 5 more than I should. So I get 52 minus 30, and when I do that, 50 minus 30 is 20. That gives me 22, but remember, I subtracted 5, 5 more than I should. That means I need to add 5 more to the answer. So that gives me 27, which means that is my final answer. Now let's see if we can do that without writing anything down at all. 86 minus 19. What I'm going to do instead is subtract 20 from 86. 86 minus 20, 8 minus 2 is 6, so 86 minus 20 is 66. But remember, I subtracted one more, so I add, have to add one more to the 66. That gives me 67, and that is the answer. Let's do this again over here. Instead of subtracting 26, I'm going to subtract 30. 43 minus 30, that gives me 13, but I subtracted 4 more than I should. 13 plus 4 gives me 17, and that's the answer. And that's how I subtract numbers like that. It makes it just a whole lot easier, and it's easier for the brain to do that. So let's try one more and see if you can know, if you can figure out how to do this. Let's take uh, the number 70, hmm, how about 73, minus 28. Let's turn that into 30, so I need to add two more to that. 73 minus 30 gives me 43, but I subtracted two more than I should. 43 plus 2 gives me 45, and that's the answer. You can very quickly in your head come up with a subtraction. All you have to do is add a couple more to that. So 73 minus 30, 43 plus 2, 45. And so very quickly you can come up with double digit subtractions without having to write anything down. You give that a try and see if you like it. And I'll come up with some more tricks for you in the next videos.